chameleons are real predators. We know that even bigger species like the Yemen chameleon, panther chameleon, Austerlitz chameleon or Meller's chameleon predominantly feed on small pollinator insects such as bees, wasps, flies or some small beetles. But they can seize a much bigger prey. In captivity, some breeders and keepers give to chameleons small vertebrates such as baby mice. They are very valuable source of processed vitamin A, which is not so widely available in other types of chameleon food. In some areas, like in Florida, chameleons are often kept in outdoor cages. Through the openings of the cages, some small lizards, such as anoles, can sneak in, and this is how they sign their death sentence. On very rare occasions, you can even make an observation like Mindy Miskaf. It was a beautiful July morning, and I had taken my chameleon down to the garden where my peas are growing to hunt for bees. Suddenly, a pair of hummingbirds came chasing through the air just above my chameleon. Through the leaves, I saw her lose her balance, and for a split second, I thought the bird had attacked her. That's when I saw, to my great surprise, that she had a hummingbird in her mouth and was beginning to swallow it. There was nothing I could do for the bird or the chameleon, so I took out my cell phone and began documenting the encounter. Afterward, she sat peacefully sunning herself and waiting for the next bee. As we are very good friends with Mindy, we have agreed on further observing the female. Imagine it took whole three weeks for her to digest the bird and afterwards she deposited a huge poop that we analyzed and it was full of feathers. We have then even compiled our observations into a paper and published them in a scientific periodical. So beware, chameleons are tiny and small and feed predominantly on insects, but they are real predators. <laughs>